I've always been interested in everything related to technology since I was a little girl and uh, I was this kind of girl uh, that likes to fix things uh, in the house and I thought that engineering would be would have been the right field to open different doors uh, in for my career for my future career. I think it's not many places in the world that we have a cryogenic station that we are using or superconducting magnets with a very, very high field and a very high current. The biggest challenge in my job is also the most fun part. I have to stay up to date with the latest technologies. This on the IT side is always evolving and the needs of the experiments can be very demanding. They're coming up with new requirements, wanting to do things more efficiently, uh, more data, and it's a real challenge to deal with these two things. Things. What is unique about my work is uh, that I don't speak my native language and I deal with uh, many, many nationalities. An additional thing that is very important of CERN is that it gives you the possibility to disseminate the result of your research through conferences, workshops and uh, meetings in general. These possibilities exist for everybody, it's just to <laughs> take it, <laughs> take it in your hands. It's a great place at CERN. Having a husband and two little children and working full time uh, in a constantly on the go and dynamic environment is my daily challenge. CERN is an incredible place to work for. There is such bright people here and it's such a stimulating environment and this has really helped me evolve. Technically all the time I have to stay up with things and there's new things evolving and it, it's, it's just an environment where you can just blossom. CERN, especially with its diverse environment, taught me that uh, it's very important to have an open mind and uh, to understand others' opinion in order to enjoy also working in team. There is a place where women can evolve in their careers, in the technical career, in the field on, on which we are. Yes, there's, a, there's something I'd like to tell you. There is so many special moments when I've worked at CERN. There's one in particular. It's several years ago. Uh, I had an office which was a few doors away from a colleague and we'd regularly pass by and catch up with each other on what we were working on. And I remember one day he was showing me a diagram full of links and he was saying, I really want to find a way to connect all this information up and that we can easily exchange this around the world. At the time we had data networks, we could exchange documents, but they were often in different formats and people couldn't read them and certainly couldn't edit them together, which is really important in our collaborative environment. And this was just a few months before he made a proposal for a project that was called the World Wide Web and his name was Tim Berners-Lee. <laughs>